Hey guys, the objective of this video is to find the permanent and imposed actions on the interior beam V1 in kilonewtons per meter. Okay, so to show you where we're at, we're trying to find the actions on beam 1 over here. Now, just a quick discussion about this shear core. This shear core will support the slabs as well. All right, so say um, this slab over here, it's going to be supported by these beams, that beam there, and also along the actual perimeter of the shear core. Okay, so for our beam B1, it's supported by a column there, and it will be supported on that edge over there um, by the shear core. Okay, so the slab's gonna transfer into the beam. This beam will be supported by column and shear core. Now, the first thing we need to do is work out the aspect ratio to determine whether our uh, system behaves, our slab rather, behaves like a one-way or two-way slab. And because the working out which one it is, is is going to be very different for the load path of the structure. So, slab one and slab two. So I'm going to call this one slab one and slab two. So obviously B1 is, is going to be supporting slab one and slab two. We're just going to work out how much loading is going into B1. So for slab one and slab two, aspect ratio is the long length over the short length. So for the slab one, the long length is four meters. The short length is three meters, so four and three, or one and a third. For slab two, it's a square, so it's four by four, so it doesn't really matter. Four by four is one, okay? So in both cases, the aspect ratio is less than two, and therefore the slab behaves like a two-way slab. Now, it's very important to discuss this. In the previous example, the load path, because it was a one-way slab, was loading from slab to interior beams or joists, to exterior beams or girders, then into column. But we're now saying that our structure behaves like a two-way slab, so more like this, all right? It's in the same plane. So if it behaves like a two-way slab, the load path is as follows. It's slab to interior beam and girder, and then both of these into the column, okay? So unlike one-way one -way slabs, which would be slab, interior beam, girder, column, this is slab, then a portion.